I love them. Coming into my first senior um, camp, I was really young, quite shy, which I'm not anymore, and just wanted to, to try and just be me and, and go out and, and have fun. It's something that you've dreamed of for a long time and then it's happening. Kind of took me a while to, to just feel calm in training and to, to get on the ball and, and just do me. But after that, I think I just took it in my stride and I think the girls helped me feel, feel at home straight away. My first camp was in November 2022. I was really nervous, to be honest. Um, I think everyone is coming into their first camp, but um, yeah, it was it was so easy to kind of settle in and I wasn't expecting to get any minutes and I was just kind of there just to see what it was like. And it was against Norway, started the game and played 90 and I came straight into it. And yeah, just very grateful that I was able to make my debut when I, when I came on my first camp. Obviously your first camp, you don't really know what they're kind of what it's going to be like, but I know the rules now, so yeah, it's, it's fine now, but I make sure that whenever anyone's coming in, I'm like, make sure you just wear socks with your sliders. Obviously, Grace just came in a few camps ago, and it's really nice that we're kind of all together and we're kind of on the journey together. It's really, really nice. Yeah, when you first get into camp, you're catching up so much. I've not stopped talking all day uh, since I've been here. I want to make sure that the, the new players who come into camp feel welcome straight away, feel like they can be themselves. And, and yeah, I think I bring a bit of banter these days as well. Now I feel welcome. Those are the nice bits. We, we go straight into the gym, do a bit of recovery. I pretend that I've got muscles and start flexing to the camera because for some reason, every video I'm flexing to the camera when I've got absolutely no muscles there, but it's just something that I like to do. <laughs> um, and yeah, just, just being reunited with everyone um, is, is always special, seeing smiles on people's faces that you've not seen for a while. And for me, it's, it's catching up with less. We saw each other this morning and we said, can't wait to spend the next 10 days sat, sat next year. So yeah, we'll make the most of every minute together. Whenever the call up is, you kind of know like in and around the day when it's gonna be, or it's gonna be on the Tuesday or the Wednesday, the list comes out and um, yeah, obviously I'm very pleased. I go back to my phone and um, my granny's text me, my family have texted me and it's been really, really nice. Um, yeah, hopefully for the ones in the future, uh, my name can still be on it, but here and now I'm just enjoying being with the girls and um, kind of getting to know everyone and seeing like the new faces that come in. We get the email not long before that it comes out on, on socials. So mum and dad straight away um, get a text from them saying how proud they are and that I deserve it. And she's on it straight away. She knows when the team's being announced on, on Twitter. So she's, she's ready for it. And then, yeah, it's, it's such a nice feeling every single time um, and something that I'm, I'm very proud of as well. I feel like I'm definitely much more comfortable in front of, in front of cameras now talking. I remember my first ever proper interview that I did, I made a word up, I said, memoriable, because I was so scared, like I was just making words up. Um, but now I think I've learned to just be myself, don't think about it too much and, and yeah, just enjoy it. And when you look back on, on videos that have been made throughout camps, it brings back so many memories. So yeah, I, I like being involved in it um, and, and just having fun with it as well. Yeah, downtime on camp, um, there's quite a lot of, of free time. So for me, I'm playing board games every single minute I can, I can play it. Um, there's a board game called Partners and there's four of us. So this camp will be me, Les, Maya and Millie. Me and Les are partners, Maya and Millie are partners. And yeah, I just absolutely love it. I never ever get bored of it. Um, and yeah, it's so serious as well, but we have such, such fun with it. Um, but yeah, for me, downtime, just spend it with my mates, spend it with less, chilling together um, and catching up. So yeah, we play our game partners. It's amazing, it's our favourite game ever. We always play it. Go for coffee, go for walks. Um, if, there's, if there's a sea nearby, I like to go and dip in the sea. So uh, yeah, and no, that's really nice. I absolutely loved Australia. Um, really found myself, enjoyed different things while I was out there. Um, obviously the tournament itself was unbelievable and I've got memories to laugh last a lifetime. Yeah, um, obviously it was bittersweet at the start. Um, obviously not getting picked for the actual 23, but to be a part of it and to be part of kind of our preparation for the World Cup is, was great for me. And uh, I think it kind of got me even more hungry, you know, for the next ones, to try and get picked for the next one and the next one. But I think we were very lucky for it to be on the Sunshine Coast. And hopefully sometime in the future, I can go back and, and see more of Australia. And then obviously this camp, sunny Spain, which will be really nice. Whenever there's a bit of sun, brings out good spirits within the team. There's a lot of laughter, a lot of smiles. But I'm gutted because I forgot my goggles, so my eyelashes might fall out by the end of camp. But I'll make sure I'm booked in afterwards so I can make the most of uh, playing in the sea with my friends.
For me, I really focus on my preparation and if I've done everything I do, usually I can take that confidence into the game knowing that I've done everything I can to prepare myself and just to let the football kind of play its part and, and do as well as I can. And obviously still young and still trying to learn and you know, playing in different positions as well, it's, it's kind of a change of mindset and you just got to kind of let your football do it and don't try and be anyone else but yourself. And um, I think I've really enjoyed that being, being a part of this England group. I think this camp I'm after enjoying training and just having fun. So many smiles. We're used to very cold weather now in England, so it'll be a it'll be a change. Um, but I want to make sure that I give 100% in training and, and keep trying to improve every single day that I'm here. I think what I look forward to the most about being called up for England is just being with the best players in England, training day in, day out with them, learning from them. Um, the standard in training is so high. Being reunited with friends who don't see a lot. Um, we have such a together group here, so it's nice to see faces that you've probably not seen for a couple of months. Um, but yeah, I absolutely love coming into camp. I love getting the call up and, and feeling excited and yeah, making sure that I just enjoy every minute of it. Heads. Oh, 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 229, that's my number now, 229. For here to be there when I, when I made my debut. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's not. No, you did actually say watch the... <laughs> 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 